So today we'll be learning how to make a memo. First thing you want to do is download the memo template. It's located in the fishbowl. Click on presentations, orientation files, and then go ahead and download the memo template. Okay, just go ahead and download that. Now, this is the template that will that will come up. As you can see, there's some header information from subject date to and CC. The from is going to be you, whoever is drafting this memo. The subject will be whatever memo you are creating. The to will, will be the lawyer assigned, which in most cases, for employment cases, will be Mr. Dewitt Lacey. And you also want to include the client as well in the to information and people who you want to cc on this memo will be james cook and also melissa the next step is to fill in all this information and let me go ahead and show you a completed form that is regarding a employment case so as you can see i put my own name as the creator the subject it's a memo of understanding. So what we did is we had a meeting with this client and she expressed her interests as to she wanted to convert her corporation. So what I did was I listed out bullet points of what we gathered during the meeting, what she wanted from the office and what she would like for her business. So as you can see, I made those points clearly here. And the next step is what our office will be doing. What we'll be sending to her and doing for her that she's paying for. So you want to list those out very clearly, exactly what we're doing. As you can see, there's six, six things that we'll be doing for this particular client. Everything is written down. And what you want to make sure you do is go ahead and make these bullet points and stay away from from long paragraphs it makes it much clearer it's clear and concise it's straight to the point this is the basic outline of how to create a memo remember the things you want to remember is the header information make it clear and also for employment meetings most likely you'll be sitting in on a meeting and you'll relay the facts in the memo of what you sat down and discussed and lastly you want to outline what our office will be doing for the particular client. And that is the basics of how you create a memo.